At the core of today's political debate lie the crucial issues of truth, media manipulation, and the integrity of our political discourse. In a time when the truthfulness of political messages is under intense scrutiny and the impact of misinformation on democratic processes is more concerning than ever, the public is grappling with the fallout of the fine people controversy. The repeated falsehoods surrounding Donald Trump's remarks have sparked immediate concerns about the spread of misinformation and a deeper fear that the very fabric of truth in public discourse is unraveling. And you had some very bad people in that group, but you also had people that were very fine people on both sides. You had people in that group, excuse me, excuse me, I saw the same pictures as you did. You had people in that group that were there to protest the taking down of, to them, a very, very important statue and the renaming of a park from Robert E. Lee to another name. And you had people, and I'm not talking about the neo-Nazis and the white nationalists, because they should be condemned totally. But you had many people in that group other than neo-Nazis and white nationalists, okay? The ongoing complaints about the distortion of Trump's fine people comments have become a flashpoint in this debate. For many, this issue exemplifies the ways in which political opponents and certain media outlets are seen as manipulating facts to serve their agendas. The persistent use of debunked narratives is viewed by many as an intentional effort to tarnish Trump's reputation and mislead the public. This has ignited a fierce defense of conservative values that prioritize truth, fairness, and accountability, especially within the realm of political discourse. The outcry is not just about protecting one individual's reputation. It's about upholding the very principles that ensure a healthy and honest democratic process where truth prevails over manipulation.